That's not true. The New York City Council voted in December to allow this. It begins January 9, 2023. Cities in Vermont and Maryland already allow this, and similar measures are under consideration in Illinois, Maine, and, and uh, Massachusetts right now. Mr. Gentleman, with you? Yes. Uh, I believe those are um, considerations of allowing votes in municipal elections only. Right, but, but th thank you. That's the point. Everybody wants to know at home, why would they allow this? Guys, they're allowing it because they're going to turn them into voters. They already are doing this in New York City. Следно той говори за това, защо идват тия нелегални мигранти. Той ка, очевидно е, приветстват ги, защото ще ги превърнат в гласоподаватели. И като ги превърнеш в гласоподаватели, и като им кажеш за кого да гласуват, на теб са ти гарантирани изборите. Само замислете. Някоя партия е на власт. Не може да е свалиш от власт. В следващия момент обаче започват хората да се надигат и да гласуват за някой друг. И тая партия, докато все още тя е на вас, има доста от най-много ресурси, почва да вкарва нелегални мигранти да му обещава безплатно здравеопазване, безплатно място за спане, кредитни карти, от които да харчат, всичко им обещава. И накрая, те обаче трябва да гласуват за теб и ти да се задържиш възта. Largest city in America, and this is the plan of our friends on this side to turn all the illegals into voters. That's it, folks. Това е планът им, да превърнат всички нелегални мигранти в гласоподаватели. Това е пичове, това е играта. На всички не е ясно какво се случва. Ето защо е отворена границата. Толкова е лесно да се спре. Но ние спират. Той поток от хора се вижда. Изриваш ги обратно, връщаш ги. Лесно се правят нещата. Well, they've dropped it. Look, I, I respect Ms. Lofgren and all her work in this arena. Yes, I'll, I'll yield, Mr. Chairman. I'd love to hear what you have to say about this. As a New Yorker, I would love to think that New York is the entire country, but it is not. <laughs> it is not, and consideration is being given to uh, uh, permitting uh, non-citizens to vote in New York, and I believe in, uh, in uh, the capital city of Vermont. I forget which that is. Uh, but it, as, as much as I'd like to believe it, New York and Vermont are not the entire country. But, Mr. Chairman, that's the whole point. This is what's going on, folks, at home. If you're trying to figure this out, if you're scratching your heads, you're seeing the video, you see droves of people, 2.4 million people coming over the border illegally, the president allowing, the Democrats in charge of Congress are allowing it. The deal is they're going to turn them into voters. You just heard it. They don't have any problem with that. They celebrate it. Here's the deal. We have a problem with it. The Constitution has a problem with it. American elections should be decided by American citizens. That's it. That's what, that's what this is about. That's why we're jumping up and down and screaming, my friends on the video who are commenting about this. That's why we're so upset, because our constituents are, 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 are frightened that we are losing our country. We're losing our security, we're losing our sovereignty, because we're going to allow people from 160 different countries around the world to come in here and decide our elections. That's it. Here it is on record. You all heard it. I'm out of time. I yield back. Ивика, айде. On record, влиза вече в документите. Знаем какво е защо се случва. Америка е свален, деца вика. 